Don't change the channel. We have singles action coming up. No one's going to change any channel. It'll be Samoa Joe against Bray Wyatt. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. And with that, the submission specialist is looking to claim another victim. Yeah, and social media has been on fire ahead of this one. But now it's time to get down to business. It's go time, people. Well, they say that Los Angeles is the city of angels, but I don't see many choir boys here tonight. And that's the way I like it. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. As the action continues, let's discuss Samoa Joe briefly. He appears to have his game face on tonight, and he better, because the guy he's in the ring there with is no nonsense. Well, I'm sure he's thinking about what a win over the champion would mean tonight. The title's not on the line, but the momentum you're riding after a win like that is huge. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Clearly trying to take out the back here. Here we go with the count. He's got 10 seconds to get back up to his feet. You know, when you look at Bray Wyatt, he may not resemble your traditional WWE superstar. But believe me, he can move in that ring. On top of his twisted mentality, Bray is strong as an ox and quick as a cat. Bray Wyatt will surprise you with his moves for someone who's six foot three and weighs 285 pounds. Samoa Joe is really going to town right now. He's got his opponent reeling and rocking. Samoa Joe really seems to have picked up some steam. What makes Bray Wyatt so dangerous is that he actually has the athletic ability and physical strength to systematically dismantle someone except Tamara Plax from Samoa Joe. Looks like he's going to test the effectiveness of that move. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. Now, why did he do that? A move like that's low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees a belt, he likes to hit below it. And it looks like this one's going out to the floor. I don't mind. Let's see a little outside the ring action. Oh, man, this is bad. This is really bad. Oh, really bad is right. This may settle the score right here. The announce table is shattered and he's down. And now the official begins the count. Every time he has to get up, it takes more and more effort. I'm not sure if I've ever experienced an eerie silence that falls over an entire arena like I do in the The referee's calling for the bell. The match is over. Here's your winner, Samoa Joe. Put it in the books. And there was no question about that one. To be honest, I was not impressed at all by Bray Wyatt.